Here we are going to introduce our latest smart recloser MT84SR. It was fully developed and patented by Matty Smart AIoT Electric. We make electricity safer and smarter. Now we are going to open this one. This is a voltage detector. This is the terminals. Here are the main products. MT84SR. This product, why we call it smart recloser, because it's really very smart. As it fully protects the voltage and the current voltage status. Whenever the voltage is uh, abnormal of over voltage or under voltage, it will trip. Only when the voltage reco re recovers to normal, it will auto reclose. All right. So this is the uh, on off status. Meanwhile, here we have the output whenever status on off 220 volts and uh, mm, this is current fault whenever the circuit breaker tripped because of the electric fault of overload or short circuit it will trip and then here the white will turn to red but manually switch off or the voltage switch off it will always white no change and it was inside mechan mechanically uh, connect. Later we will show you how it functions. And this is for maintenance lock. So when this lock is put out, all the remote control, all the auto reclose will be disabled. Okay, it will be disabled or everything, no work. Only when it recovers, it will be able to switch on. Mode, it's, we have the auto reclose when the current fault ex exists and uh, uh, happens, this we have also the program to auto reclose for three times, 10 seconds, uh, 60 seconds, and 300 seconds for this three times auto reclose. All right. So this is the uh, front uh, front panel. Here we will see more. Uh, this this device is follows EN five zero five five zero. Okay. Uh, European standard. This is the output for the 220 volts AC com and the current fault. So when this current fault happens, this this indicator, and uh, here we will output a signal to alarm. And uh, one and the three is the status on off. When the handle is off, it will output a sig signal on output a signal to understand. All right. So this is the input to, to read the uh, dry contacts with the relay. Four and the five is, is uh, close. When four and the five connects, five, four and the five connects, it will reclose. Four and the six connects, it will be off. This is RS485, seven. Eight is A, nine is B, seven is uh, ground. All right, this is uh, here, this. So we have two terminals, both sides here. All right. And, uh, and also, this is three phase. How to get power from here to the uh, main device. It was through this one. Uh, these are galvanized by gold. It's really very tough, very strong to real sensitive. A, B, C, A, B, C how to read in is this is the N design to get the cables connect here and the uh, power will be input from here to here and all this all this uh, voltage from neutral to a a n b n c n will be all fully protected we will protect all them any of this phase get abnormal voltage it will be protected only and then it will auto reclose when it recovers. All right, so it's very simple. And meanwhile, how to do if uh, we have the single phase or two two pole uh, or three poles? So this is the one with the two pole with the voltage detector. This is for the one pole. All right, so LAN neutral also is connect like this. All right, simple. This for the two pole. This one is already yeah connected with the lines, and we have the two pole voltage. It's like this. When we power on, okay, it will be powered on. This is already connected, and then this is the four four phase. All right, it's also the same. Very simple, installed. So.
in this case, and uh, we can supply this device in two way. Firstly, we can supply with the whole together. Everything is un under uh, prepared and uh, uh, checked. Meanwhile, we can also supply this one plus the, this voltage, and then you can you can uh, use whatever you want. Okay, we can supply like this. So when you receive this device, you can do uh, whichever to save your warehouse and the stock. Okay, for all the one, two, three, four posts device. And uh, however, when you install the breaker with the, our device MT8 to four SR together, we must be careful that uh, the both handle will be on the off statues. All right. So this is the part to read the current fault from here. Okay, so this is the part to read the current fault. It's mechanically, so for safety. So whenever the current fault overload or short circuit happens, the MCV protects the electric fault, protects, and here we get detection from here. And then we get output both current fault here by mechanically, and also this uh, statues on off output remotely. All right, so we need to switch on them together. Here we have five, a few points. Six point one, two, three, four, five, six, six, six point. When we match them, both of them are off statues. All right, off. Okay. So, and then we need to switch on uh, here. Okay. So now let's power on this two pole. Smart Recloser MT84 together with the Tupo MCB. Okay, now it's uh, powered on. So we are going to uh, power on from this. Uh, this is a governed by gold, very tough. And uh, we can both uh, power the through the here to these two terminals and input the power from this. And meanwhile, it will also read the voltage between the new neutral and the lines. All right, so press in okay tightly right away we are going to this is powered on okay so uh, we can firstly try with this uh, uh, dry contacts okay this strong dry contacts is uh, now is in the on status we are going to do this open it's a four and a six okay when we connect this four and a six it will be uh, tripped four and a six Okay, it's tripped. This is a remotely controlled through dry contacts, and then open is uh, closed is five and six, five and six. Okay, closed. Let's try again. Four and six, five and six. Okay, so this is a dry contacts input. This is remotely controlled, and then let's try this uh, voltage voltage detection. For this voltage. Voltage detection we follow EN five zero five five zero means the voltage is uh, very high, highly it will trip very fast as well. If it's uh, less, then it also uh, we have we have the delay time. This is uh, we follow the standards of the over voltage. For example, very fast it will trip right away. Okay, and then it becomes red. Voltage is two hundred twenty five. Uh, when we switch voltage to the normal less than 260 uh, it's uh, 275 so the red the over voltage is flashing because normal and uh, the recover voltage is 255 so less than 255 it will be uh, waiting for around 30 seconds it will auto reclose this is the off status it will always uh, output whenever uh, the handle is on or off okay so now the voltage is become stable uh, red keeps flashing this is a stable time we have another uh, a few seconds to be stable only when this one is stable it means this is fully protected uh, finished and then waiting for the next electric fault uh, okay and uh, this is the current later we will try with uh, this current uh, here to see okay now it uh, becomes red uh, green means this over voltage protection is finished now let's try this one okay chipped see the white turn to red 
here we output this current fault one and two output this signal all right however if we do manually okay it will be in the white okay and then like we can try it again it's uh, switched on it's white and uh, okay off it's white it's red right away okay when the voltage is normal it will be switched on when the voltage is uh, uh, low under voltage okay like uh, 160 160 okay it will be tripped and uh, when it recovers okay recovers to normal it will be red under voltage flashing it means uh, becomes to it will auto recall right away so here is the standard when the voltage is higher than 275 5 seconds to a trip higher than 300 volts 1.5 seconds higher than 350 volts less than 0 0.3 seconds very fast so over voltage the when the voltage is less than 160 3 seconds it will trip okay this is follow the standard now is the charging points it will take another few seconds to to make sure this uh, auto auto recalls uh, is uh, stable and uh, confirmed so this is for the voltage protection in the current fault meanwhile this mode is uh, uh, when this light is in green it means the voltage functions and all these are remotely functions and then when we press this one for another uh, four seconds it will change to green and red green and red this is the mode for the manually mode it means the manual manual mode all these remotely are disabled remotely function are disabled manual function only okay this is the mode meanwhile when we continue to press for another four seconds it will change to the red okay now red means uh auto reclose even even when this uh power okay the now is the circuit fault okay car red car and circuit fault it will auto reclose in uh, less than 10 seconds it will auto reclose if we press again all right it will waiting for another uh, 60 seconds it will auto reclose again for three times auto reclose all right and meanwhile this is a lock uh, this is a lock when the lock is uh, switched on it will be unable to switch on okay only when the lock is uh, off it will be able to switch on okay is unable to switch on anymore. Switch on. Okay. Thank you.